I'm Patrick Chain. I work at Los Alamos National Lab. I'm a genomics researcher and bioinformatics specialist. Uh, genomics is a field of biology that studies genomes uh, using sequencing um, and tries to understand function from DNA. Edge Bioinformatics uh, is a piece of software that my group has developed that helps researchers better understand the mountains of data coming out of next generation DNA sequencers. Currently, most researchers go through a very large number of steps to make sense of the data. Here we're making a piece of software that's accessible to individuals without bioinformatics expertise. In that way, democratizing the field of genomics and allowing any person to really look at and understand um, these complex uh, DNA sequencing data. And genomics information is helpful to the average person in many different areas. For example, understanding uh, diseases like Huntington's disease or sickle cell anemia, um, you can understand that on a genetic basis, but it also plays roles in other areas. For example, the recent Ebola outbreak, uh, there was a lot of sequencing conducted there to understand epidemiology or the spread of the disease, as well as to understand how better to target uh, areas of the virus for vaccine production. So genomics information can also be used in the hospital setting. So I envision a future where most doctors will have access to sequencing technology and will readily be able to analyze your um, samples on the spot and understand what kind of infectious disease you might be uh, suffering from. One area where genomics can play a role in health issues, human health issues, is in unraveling the mysteries in the human microbiome. Uh, the organisms that live inside and on you and determining what the interactions are between them and you to help enlighten mysteries that remain in Alzheimer's or in diabetes research. Our Edge Bioinformatics platform is being used across the board in science, not only in healthcare, in um, agriculture, looking at plant genetics, also looking at uh, algal biofuels, we have a number of projects in that area, as well as in the impacts of climate on microbes in general. The laboratory has been involved in genomics for quite some time, starting with the Human Genome Project and even before looking at radiation effects on the human genome, and has continued in that tradition looking at technologies and improving upon technologies for DNA sequencing and for the analytics. And currently we're involved in a large number of projects that span across biofuels to uh, identifying pathogens in complex uh, human clinical samples. I'm Patrick Chain. I forget who I am. Of <laughs> course. <laughs> Don't worry, there'll be plenty more of those. I'll be like, what am I doing here? <laughs>